I'm grateful that it happened. I wish it didn't have to go this far. Bayonne Zoning Board approved the city's first mosque last night. It will be built on 24th Street on the east side. After years of controversy, this defunct factory will be transformed into this. The Justice Department opened an investigation into whether religion played a role in the board's denial a year ago, but residents say this is about congestion. The Justice Department opened an investigation into whether religion played a role in the board's denial a year ago, but residents say this is about congestion. Why is this a problem in this neighborhood? Well, basically, it's a quiet area. Whether this was a supermarket or a movie theater, we would have the same problem. Longtime resident Joseph Wisniewski points to a housing development already going up across the street. There's going to be a ton of traffic here. It's pretty, I'm actually thinking about moving. Really? Yes. Even after living here your whole life? Yes, I'm just disgusted. I've fought this battle for three years. The neighborhood's never going to be the same. Other towns in New Jersey have had to pay multi million dollar settlements after fighting mosque proposals in their townships. At the meeting in Bayonne last night, city officials did note that it would likely be a lengthy and expensive legal battle. I feel, you know, where they're coming from. Um, I just feel that they haven't understood. We're a peninsula city, we're close to New York City, mm -hmm. uh, the proximity, the development. That's going on in the city. We need to get on board. I think this is a way of the future. The nonprofit group Bayonne Muslims did sue the city and settle. They got $400,000. They will now focus on fundraising and filing permits to begin construction on this site. In Bayonne, New Jersey, I'm Christy Duffy, Pix 11 News.